In this problem, we're being asked to write a proof. Uh, they want us to prove that A and B, these two lines, are parallel. And you can see they're in this figure where you have two lines cut by a transversal. By this point, you should know a lot about figures like this. Some things you should know. If those lines are parallel, if A and B are parallel, then corresponding angles are, are the same measure, are congruent. So corresponding angles like 1 and 3 would be the same. Also, alternate interior angles uh, should be the same. So 2 and 6 would be alternate interior angles. Those should be the same. Alternate exterior angles uh, should also be the same. So 1 and 5 would be alternate exterior angles. So if any of those pairs of, of angles are congruent, then these lines are parallel. If the lines are parallel, then all of those pairs of angles are congruent. It works both ways. So this should actually be a pretty easy proof to complete. We are being told that angle 2 and angle 6 are congruent, and, and those are alternate interior angles. And we just said if alternate interior angles are congruent, then the lines are parallel. So that is basically our proof. We just need to write it out in a slightly more official way. Let me uh, grab a different tool so I can pop into the text box here. So I'm going to say, <clears throat> first of all, angle 2 uh, is congruent to angle 6. And the reason there is that it's given. So we don't really need any more than that. And then we can just say that A is parallel here we go, to B. The reason here is that if alternate interior angles are congruent, then lines are parallel in a figure like this where you have two lines cut by a, a transversal. And I guess I should refer, I should number my lines here. Let's call this one 1, and we'll call this one 2. And this refers to, or uses information in line 1. And that's really all we need here. This is the whole proof. Um, angle 2 is congruent to angle 6 because it's given. And therefore, A is parallel to B because of the alternate interior angles thing. So that is a quick introduction to a proof with parallel lines.